Joe Biden could fix this with a phone call. He could save kids in this country. Who goes to Chicago public schools? Rich kids? Uh, no, they go to Francis Parker. It's poor kids. And Joe Biden could save them. And we would praise him for doing that because we're not partisan, actually. But no, they're doing the opposite. The Biden administration is praising the Chicago teachers unions. Those teachers are the future of this country, Joe Biden tells us. They're not scientists, of course. They're not even good dancers. But they are huge donors to the Democratic Party. Joe Biden's not going to criticize them. In the last election cycle, teachers unions donated more than $4 million to Democratic Party candidates in Congress. They gave fewer than 50 grand to Republicans. Of course, I'll tell you, this isn't about money. It's about science. But science, unlike the teachers unions, has changed quite a bit during this pandemic. Now science is telling us we need to wear two masks instead of just one. In fact, experts on other networks are suggesting we might need to wear three masks just to be safe. Think of it like triple bagging your face. It's the only way to be safe. So if you have a physical covering with one layer, you put another layer on, it just makes common sense that it likely would be more effective. And that's the reason why you see people either double masking or doing a version of an N95. So double masking is now just common sense, just common sense. How long are people gonna put up with this? Follow the logic. Wouldn't it just be safer at this point for people just to stop breathing entirely? You wouldn't get COVID. You get the impression that's kind of where Tony Fauci may be a few months from now. Back in March, before he was allowed to appear on MSNBC's primetime shows, Tony Fauci wasn't just opposed to double masking. He was opposed to any masking, to masks, remember? Right now in the United States, people should not be walking around with masks. You're sure of it, because people are listening really no, closely to this. Uh, right now, people should not be walking. There's no reason to be walking around with a mask. When you're in the middle of an outbreak, wearing a mask might make people feel a little bit better, and it might even block a, a droplet, but it's not providing the perfect protection that people think that it is. This guy's a malignant buffoon. He is, and the teachers unions are actively hurting children they are. Why are we listening to any of these people?